I've fitted plastic tyres to my Suron electric motorbike and we're going drifting. Hello everyone, today is going to be epic because it's all about the Suron Light B and it's newly fitted plastic tyres. The video did start differently though, we were doing a little bit of urban like this. Oh, yo! I then got a mind spark midway through filming. We rushed home, cut some plastic piping, then this happened. Oh my god, what's that? There's a tennis ball in there. Oh my god. Oh! 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 <laughs> Whoa! Proper! Cool, well that was a fun interlude. Let's continue making drift tyres. And after all that fun, we're now left with some plastic coated tyres. This is some sort of guttering and it fits perfectly around there. And we're gonna drift heavily right now. So excited for it. I actually don't want it all to fly off straight away though, so. Oh my God, it's. Oh yeah, this is gonna be the best thing ever. I might put it in less power mode actually. Oh, it all come off. Wait, I'm drifting with my stand is down. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. oh my, oh, it's from that. What a mess I've made. I actually didn't even think about it that it works without the plastics. <laughs> oh, it's actually way, whoa. It didn't even need the plastics, it's insane. Wow, this thing drifts like an absolute dream. It kind of sucks after all that work, just the plastic has now become littered all around this car park. We will pick it up in a second, but I've just found the ultimate location for an Urberm. This is what an Urberm is. Oh, Urberm's insane actually, isn't it? Oh, Urberm! Oh! In all this pandemonium, I forgot to mention, I've got a new Ortrad design. We wanna launch these before Christmas. So you can literally have one day only of pre-order open now. So we're gonna have multiple t-shirt colors with this new flavor on there. This is just a sample one. We're gonna have like white, black, a few multicolor ones. It's gonna be well good. So you want one, get involved. Links up here are in the description. All this playing around drifting on the Suron just reminded me that quads drift so good. We're in a little micro climate here in this private estate. There's like a proper good corner you can drift. So let's get in here, flat out, back it in. Drift, 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 power off, dream. <laughs>
big switch up and I'm now joined by Alison. This part of the video is for the wives and girlfriends out there watching to show you that you can get involved in mountain biking too. I'm also going to be trying to do a few cool bangers as well for those guys that are still watching that don't want your minds numbed. So <laughs> let's start off by getting you warmed up with a few sort of slopes to ride down, yeah? First challenge then, down that slope. Get it? Whoa, straight in and air. Okay, it's actually gonna be a good day. Right, let's just ramp it up heavily. Go down that. Guys, the best encouragement you can give to your girlfriends or other halves is peer pressure. When I go over the handlebars on the route. Don't get nervous, just go. Go, go, go lean back. Yo. See? Well good. There's quite a steep, sketchy bit there. I'm gonna come in fast, nose manual. Straight down there. Yeah, let them off so you get, let them off. Yeah, flying. I just found a huge rampage gap there to there. Oh! That was quite a good little uh, launch there, but you got to come and do this steep thing over here. Prepare to be terrified. This is the next spot then, look. It's quite steep, treacherous, scary. And I'm gonna go down there and film you do it. Go on then. Yeah. Nice, look at that. You actually made that look way too easy. Very impressive. Air time? Okay. Cool, she said yes. Just got to the table and someone has made it rain there. So we can't really do that because you might slide on the lip and then you'll crash into that ditch there. We're gonna find a new option for airtime, all right? <laughs> right, we found an option. It's quite wet down here today. So some of the best stuff's blocked off. But we've got a fly out here. Bit slidey in there though. So that could cause some issues. Right, she's in on the Special line choice. Oh my goodness. She got mud in the face. That is mountain biking, love. Next lap, less braking, more pull up. Ooh, in again. Oh my goodness. That was a full front wheel higher. That was, no, it was good. Just I think you pulled a bit too much. I can't win. Here we go. Good. Whoa! <laughs> You've done a full drop off of that drop off. Oh, that was quite interesting. That was cool. You almost got squirrely because it's all wet down there. That was proper. That was free ride. It even made your hat go wonky. I like the iPhone. It's like behind the scenes, but not because this is a vlog. Um, as we can see, it is possible for you to come and join in with the lads. If you're a bit nervous and jump that was probably i'd say maybe your fifth bit of air time in total of yeah, all jumps yeah. so probably two sessions she's now at that level it's obviously a bit wet we wanted to try and clear the table over there properly but let's find another little thing maybe a drop off could be cool because that's quite a technical maneuver in the bike world yay i found a perfect little drop here so here's a quick tutorial search for a zone that's got a nice flat landing. You want to approach it at a good speed and then pull up on the bars like this. Approach, pop, then it speed like that. And then you've got yourself a drop off. If you're learning, make sure it doesn't have a gap or you'll die. Go on, Alison. Wow, sick. Now go a bit quicker and you'll do a proper drop. Whoa. <laughs> So free ride and weak army. That was almost a little incident, but most importantly, if you scare yourself, get back up, do it again. She's in for her rampage drop. Pop it. Yes. Pop it. Yes. Yeah, that was well good with the drop. Just go fast, pull up, pop, drop. You got it. You dropped two foot and cleared the gap there. That's well cool. Also, earlier I said, 
these new designs are available. This is the black version. We've also got these versions available as well. And they are only pre-orderable now. We're going to do a really short one because we want to get them out before Christmas. So if you want one, get involved! Right, I've just thought of a good one for you. There's a huge, like, steep bit there. So head up there now and then we can get you down that for the finale. It's going to be so cool. Sorry guys, I wanted to make the most of this cool mask and Halloween. I hope you had a good one. What you want to do now is film an Insta clip with this mask on for Halloween that you will have seen yesterday if you follow me on Instagram because Halloween was actually yesterday. Let's do it. Go. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't here to scare. I was here to impress. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Oh, that is so hard to see. Look, this is what it looks like through here. It's impossible to ride like that. Halloween. Well, that was difficult to ride in. It's like one dimensional view, but that was the Insta clip. Happy Halloween, everyone. Don't forget to get your orders in. This was a mishmashy video, but I hope it was somewhat enjoyable for you guys. See you in the next one. Let's go.